Hey guys, this is Brandy and tonight I'm coming to you with a quick video. I decided to throw my hat into the couponing ring and start to coupon a little bit more to save money for myself and my family. So, um, I had always like asked my mail carrier to give me extra coupons and I never really did anything with them. I actually just recycled them because I just thought it was so much like so much to actually do to coupon. So I just never. But recently something I don't know what it was, but it was just like maybe you should try this again, like just try it. So I decided this week that I was going to whatever coupons came in the mail that I was just going to cut them out and see what I could possibly get. And I decided that I was going to start at the Dollar Tree and not overwhelm myself trying to match it with like an ad or, you know, all of that, getting into all of that Walgreens, CVS and all that stuff. Because if I frustrate myself that I'm just like, you know what, I don't even want to do it anymore. Now you see why I don't do it. But long story short, I clicked a few coupons from today is the 19th of August and I clipped coupons I think it might have been I recycled the other part because I just didn't need them but I think it was I don't know whether it was Red Plum or Smart Source but either way I clipped the coupons and I went to the Dollar Tree and I was able to pick up I went to actually two Dollar Trees so the first one was Wednesday and then I went also again tonight and grabbed some other stuff but let's just get right into it the first things that I purchased at that time, um, which was really good for this couponing process, were these 10 um, sheets of coupon organizers. So I got two of those, and I thought that would be good to get me started off with couponing. And I'll probably wind up going back to get another one just in case, maybe two. And then I picked up this cute little coupon organizer follow flex mini type thing and it came with the they're in here it came with the little labels they're somewhere around here they might have fell out but I thought this was really cute and it was like my favorite colors in here the next thing that I picked up and actually used a coupon for was the um palm olive dishwashing liquid there was a 25 cent off coupon in the Sorry, there was a 25, 25 cent off coupon in the coupons that came in my mail this week. And I was watching another YouTuber and she was saying that if you were going to do the coupons to actually look for the ones that had the extra percentage of goods in there. So this one was 25% more free. So for 75 cent, you can't beat that. And um, so that was that. And then I also picked up this Colgate and this is the whitening, whitening with baking soda and peroxide. And I had a 50 cent off coupon for this. So this came down to 50 cent. And in, in those coupons, um, there was also a $3 off of Bic razors. And I picked up the razors that you guys probably seen in all the YouTube videos. And I picked up three of those because the coupon said $3 off. And then if you look at the fine print or the frequently frequently asked questions on the Dollar Tree website they will tell you on the coupon that you can match up to the amount on the coupon but cannot exceed so since it was three dollars off of any big razors it couldn't be trial size or anything like that I was able to pick up three razors because it equaled three dollars so I got three of these I have never used these I just thought that they would be cool just to throw in my suitcase I've been doing a lot of traveling back and forth out of town so I thought that would be good to do you know a quick touch up before I leave the hotel room or wherever I'm staying at for that um time so that was it for the first time and then I went again this evening before I came home and I also took two more coupons I had a bunch of coupons but I was only able to use two because everything else I was looking for wasn't in the store so I was able to pick up the refill of the soft soap in the antibacterial and this was 35 cent off, so that came down to 65 cent. And I also picked up one of the infamous Bounty Basic rolls. I only had one physical coupon that I printed off of the internet for this, and this was 25 cent off. So 75 cent um, 
for a roll of paper towels is actually a good deal because I normally buy them from Sam's Club or Costco, whichever one me and my boyfriend happen to just stop at that day because we have memberships to both. Um, because you figure they give you 15 rolls for about maybe a dollar and some change a piece. So you figure 75 cents for a roll is not bad at all. But I also, I was telling my son that I was looking for a binder to house my coupons. And he actually picked up, picked out this one. He pointed this one out to me, which y'all know that pink is like my favorite, 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 favorite color. And this is a one inch binder from the Dollar Tree. It smells like my soap. And then I also picked up. I've seen a YouTube video where a couponer had a little pencil pouch in it where they kept like their ca mini calculator or scissors or whatever the case may be just in case they are out and about and they won't, you know, didn't have to go searching for something to cut out these coupons. So I thought this was absolutely adorable because it did have the polka dots in the pink and white. I thought that would be cute to actually clip inside of the binder and keep some scissors and, you know, um, anything like that just so that I'm not like overwhelming myself you know just starting out couponing and then I also picked up these poly file folders which I am probably going to use my um, blade and I'm going to um, you know do some whatever maneuvering so that I can fit this for my coupon banner to keep everything organized and I'm actually probably going to do a quick little video tonight to show you guys how I'm going to start my coupon binder because like I said I'm just starting out and I don't want to overwhelm myself because then I will just throw in the towel like you know what I'm done it's not worth it but that is it for my mini first coupon haul and I thought I was going to have the worst experience couponing at Dollar Tree sometimes they are not the nicest and um I was just like, if this turns into a headache, I swear I'm just going to put it back and just walk out of the store because it's really not worth the headache. So, but that is it. And like I said, stay tuned. I'm going to do that video next where I actually go into the um, putting together my first time coupon binder and all of that stuff. So thanks for watching, rate, comment, and subscribe. And the details today, I decided to do my makeup. I work from home so I don't get dressed every day for work I just go into my other room once I wake up and get myself situated I go into my other room and I work so Fridays are like my dress up day and my family is always like where are you going like you got on makeup you got on this you got on that it's like well I don't get dressed during the week so this is like my day to like actually glam myself up and put on real clothes and not pajamas or yoga pants or something like that so but on my lids i am wearing the two eyeshadows a red and an orange from our line beauty and if you follow me on instagram i think i put a lot of the details in there and i will link my instagram account below but i'm wearing those two colors blended with a little bit of a brown on the corner i'm wearing um kiss lashes what else am I wearing? I'm I was wearing I just actually wiped it off after dinner. I was wearing the um lipstick from Sephora collection and it's like a reddish orange like a brick color and it is from the MAC collection which normally wears longer but I was just like wiping it off crazy when I was eating dinner. But that is it for my first time couponing Dollar Tree haul and hopefully I'll be able to get into the swing of things you know printing down coupons and cutting coupons and my goal for Sunday is to go and buy at least four to five newspapers to cut out the coupons and try to start from there and not overwhelm myself but that's it that's all I got for you guys hopefully this video didn't bore you to death I think I'm at nine minutes so that's it thanks for watching